Noticed your MagSafe charger getting unusually hot? You're not alone. While MagSafe makes charging more convenient and efficient, excessive heat can impact performance and longevity. Today, we'll uncover why this happens. How to identify if your charger is overheating. And practical steps to keep your charging safe and effective. Is it normal for MagSafe chargers to get hot? Yes. To some extent. Like all electronic devices, MagSafe chargers produce heat due to energy conversion. This heat generation is common in wireless charging and not unique to MagSafe. Wireless charging involves electromagnetic fields transferring power without physical connectors. And some energy is lost as heat due to resistance. While some heat is normal and expected, MagSafe technology includes safety features to manage temperature and prevent excessive heat. If your charger feels uncomfortably hot, it might signal a malfunction or improper use. Addressing these issues promptly is crucial to avoid damage and ensure safety. While some warmth is normal, it's important to recognize signs of excessive heat to prevent damage. Overheating can result from using incompatible accessories, charging in hot environments, poor ventilation, or obstructions like metal objects or thick cases. Here's how to tell if your MagSafe charger is getting too hot. 1. Uncomfortably hot. If the charger is too hot to touch for more than a few seconds, it's likely overheating. Point 2. Charging interruptions. If charging stops or becomes intermittent, it could be a safety response to excess heat. 3. Discoloration or warping. Physical changes like discoloration or warping are signs of overheating. If you notice any of these signs, it's important to address the issue right away. Consider these methods to resolve the problem and ensure safe charging. 1. Use MFI certified chargers to ensure safe charging. Always use an MFI certified MagSafe charger. Non-certified chargers may not meet Apple's strict quality and safety standards, leading to potential overheating. Opt for reliable options like the Anchor 3 in 1 cube with MagSafe or Anchor MagGo wireless charging station. These chargers not only meet certification standards but also offer 15 watts fast charging for your iPhone, Apple Watch, and AirPods. All in a compact, travel-friendly design with adjustable viewing angles. 2. Choose MagSafe compatible cases. Use cases designed for MagSafe to avoid blocking the magnetic connection and heat dissipation which helps keep both the charger and your phone cooler. 3. Minimize usage. Try to limit heavy usage of your phone while it's charging to reduce additional heat generation. 4. Check for faults. Inspect your charger for any damage like frayed cables or bent connectors. Replace any damaged chargers immediately to avoid safety risks and ensure efficient charging. Understanding why your MagSafe charger gets hot is key to keeping your device safe and running smoothly. Some warmth is normal. But excessive heat signals a problem. Stick to MFI certified chargers. Follow best practices and enjoy safe, reliable charging. Thanks for watching.